What's up guys, it's Jem Starling here and I'm here to tell you some news. As you can tell from the title, yes, I do vape. I <sighs> spoke to my mom about it. She wasn't really ecstatic about it. Like, I don't agree with it, but you know, it's got CBD in it. So, I mean, what I do is I pour in most of my favorite flavor or any vape juice, by the way, which I have three of them at the moment. Uh, Air Factory Wild Apple, 100 milliliters, zero milligrams of nicotine. Uh, keep it 100, Blue Slushy, one of my favorites. Mm -mm -mm. I love it. I like it a lot. Oh, let me not put that there. Uh, now, here's the thing. When people say, oh, but it does have nicotine. Yeah, okay, look at look at this. Okay. Now look at this. That don't say OMG, that says zero milligrams of what? Nicotine, cause I make sure it's nicotine free. Cause this was in the, the nicotine free thing. So by law, they have to put that there, but it doesn't have nicotine. Cause I looked it up, I did my research and if it did have nicotine, I wouldn't have it. So with that being said, let's put these on back over here. Blue slushy though, damn, that's good stuff. This is the Skittles flavor. Uh, what's it called again? Aqua Drops, I think. Aqua Rainbow Drops. I peeled off the thing because I couldn't see where I was at. I like the one. I like the bottles that do this. Hold on. I like the when they do this. I like when they do that. Where you can see where you're at. Okay, where I can see where they're at. Now, I don't really vape, vape this one and that one because they're really, really good. But I don't, I, you know, this one I don't really mind because it's, you know, a thinner bottle, so it costs less. So, with that being said, <clears throat> let's begin with, a, with mod number one. So, this mod right here is the Smock Majesty uh, resin edition as you could tell it's the green one I wanted to get the blue one but I he didn't have the blue one so I settled for this give me one second let me get my batteries in on deck a two 18650s are needed to power this baby up right. so make sure you put them in the right way so you don't wind up looking like an idiot uh, in there where there's light you'll see a minus or a plus the minus goes flat part down and the plus goes not so flat part down let me see if I still have it uh, yes yes I do have it okay so this is something that's very important that I think people should look at often especially people who are beginners if it looks like that that or that don't put it in if it's even unwrapped in the slightest way get rid of it i don't know why but i think something bad will happen if you don't which is why i always make sure that my batteries are good which they are i do plan on uh getting uh batteries that last longer but since i get i see i'm you know i'm still starting i'm you know i'm not a beginner but you know i'm, I'm, I'm pretty lit you know when it comes to this kind of stuff I like starter kits because they're simple, they're basic, they, they're they they're good looking. You know, I'm not about the wick and wire kind of sit here and just twist it, twist it, twist it, put it in the, you know. I like, like, simple. I don't like five clicks to turn it on. Smock, you see that right there? Majesty, you see that? Yeah. Uh-huh. And this little side thing right here, uh, let me put it all the way to the lowest wattage point. Six watts. Okay, it's not doing anything. Uh, as you can see, I'm not allowed to vape inside the house, of course. But um, I I do wish that I could just like out the window. Because if, if I got permission for that, then I totally would. You know, I, would, I wouldn't be stuck there all day long. Like, I, you know, a couple times. You know, maybe three, four times an hour. It doesn't matter to me. I mean... I mean, you know, it, you know, it's going outside. What's the worst that can happen? But whatever. I'll talk to people about that later. Can't even do a simple video. Because the disrespect is real. But I can't say anything to them. Because the way I would say it, they would hate me. They already hate me. I don't care. Uh, 
Now this one's a little more complex. Now you see this, it goes up to six and it goes all the way up. It's pretty fast going up with the watts. Really? I thought it was 245. Oh well, must have been wrong. Uh, okay, that's normal. That is supposed to happen. Uh, I just got startled by it because I didn't expect such a loud crackling noise. Uh, I don't really know what it what it means, but I looked it up online. They said it's fine. It's supposed to happen. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, three clicks takes you to the mode setting. So, as you can see here, it's... Oh, come on. Here we go. <clears throat> Drop that one. That's why That's why I need to have more space in this. Because this, this isn't going to cut it. This ain't going to cut it. I almost lost something. I need that something for another video that I'm doing similar to this one. But, um, yeah. It, what? You jerk. So it takes you to the watts. And it does wattage. Come on! Getting pissed off. I'm legitimately losing my shit here. Okay. It got, it does wattage. Titanium. Nickel. I don't know what the SS stands for, but... And back to wattage. Hey, look. Oh, and it also has M for memory. So if you want to set it up in a way that you don't have to worry about putting up and down every time you put a tank on this thing, uh, it'll remember that. But I don't really care because I don't mind, you know. Uh, puff setting, it takes account of how many puffs you've taken. Uh, I have not cleared this one uh, because I don't really care how, much, how many puffs I take because it's not really important. But according to this thing and the many times that I use it, uh, I never clear the puff one. I, I don't care much about it. I don't want to keep count. Uh, puff counter is 380 puffs. Not in one day. Chill. Uh, then there's the color settings. Uh, you have blue, green, white, red, yellow, orangish type of... And purple, which I, since this thing is green, I choose that one. And then there's a power off. Now, you can't just click it and say I'm done. You have to hold it, and then it shows you the label, I'm the company, and goodbye. But we're not done here yet. Sometimes I click it six times. I don't know. It's a, it's a habit. It happens. Uh... <sighs> So two twenty, it goes up to 225. I haven't seen if it does something that a lot of people call round robin, which is where 225, you're at 225 right now, you say you're vaping it and you want to go down to a lower thing without having to go all the way back to the beginning. So you press the up thing, the up button to up the wattage, it does not round robin. So you have to hold the down wattage part and go all the way down. I can't even make it to 90 watts, so I go down to 600, and for shits and giggles, I do that much. Fight me. So, yeah. Then you click the, okay, what is titanium, nickel, something, something, and then, no, I don't use that. Okay, careful with that. Never this, that. <laughs> then you press the up for the wattage. It, it tells you the different kinds of modes you can have it on. Now you got soft vapor, normal vapor, and hard vapor production. I have it on hard because I like to. I'm a cloud chaser, so I know. I like when I do that. I like to see it just float away. I don't know what it is about the visual of doing that. It's just, it's just so cool to me. Uh, I think. I think that other people don't really like it. They don't care about the uh, the way it looks. But I do, since it's mine. I'm going to do it how I want to do it. So, there's that. And this tank, in case I didn't say it before, I think I might have. But, in case I didn't, it's called the Smock X-Baby T6. 
So if you want this, I mean, top airflow, come on now. Top airflow, you know, top airflow. A lot more of these need to be coming out, vape companies. Hello, please do this. Do this. Por favor, please do this. Come on. Top airflow. You don't have to worry about leakage coming out to the bottom when you first uh, fill it up through the hole. Okay, so how you do that, I'm going to show you on, an, on another uh, tank that I can't find. I, yeah, this is the one that the glass was broken, and I dropped it, and I was really upset. Um, I have to kind of clean this one, too. It's not dirty, but I just like to make sure that there's nothing in it. Ugh. Yeah, so what you would do is you would, you know, this one... There's a button over here, and it yeets itself open like that. And then you look over here. There's a little hole right there. See that one? You pour it into there. You pour your e-juice into there. I'm not going to demonstrate it because the glass is too small. I got the wrong glass on this one. I don't know why I haven't changed that. But do not pour anything in that middle hole right there. That's where the stuff is supposed to come out, not where the stuff is supposed to go in. So, yeah, there's that. This operates the same way. So, yeah, there's that. Smock Majesty. Thing of beauty. I love it. Look at look, look how beautiful. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Mm-hmm. And it came with a micro USB, so you can just charge that. Do not have it on, though, because I found that it gets a little bit warm when you have it on and it's charging at the same time. So don't do that. Um, another battery-operated one, I believe, that I have. I have one, two, three... No, that's it. Only three battery-operated ones. Another one that I have, which came with the Eloduro uh, tank, uh, which I can no longer use because I don't know where the rubber band. I might have to order the kit all the tank all over again, which is upsetting to me. But at least the tank isn't as expensive as I thought it was going to be. Fifteen, twenty dollars the most. Um, but yeah, this is the. The e leaf lexicon. It's really nice. I, you know, these little white line things are here for the. It, it, it does lights. Uh, it doesn't light up as much as I thought it would because I wish there was one that would do strobe lights. Like, you know, but then, you know, seizure warnings and people just, you know, you're next to someone. You know, I'm not making fun of people that have seizures. I, I feel bad. I honestly do. But it would be pretty cool, you know, to have that at a party. Freaking going to a party. Woo! You know what I mean? But most of the parties I go to are indoors, so. Um, and that's that. These two, I'm not put, I'm not doing this one in an alternate video because it upsets me. I do not have the tank for that. I do, but it's messed up, and I have to buy another one. Uh, all in due time. All in, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna kill myself over that. Um, I don't know what these little screws are for, but I would not take this out. I don't know why anyone would want to take this off. But that's up to them. So, this is my first battery-operated uh, mod. And, the okay, I'm going to do that in another video. I just came up with a little bit of an idea to do this after I review all the mods and stuff. I, okay, do I recommend this? Yes. But not for beginning vapors. Uh, because, for starters, I mean, one, two, three, four, five, turns it off. No, wait. No! Okay. <laughs> this one's a little different. For most of the mods that I have, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 clicks, turns it on. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 turns it on. In this case, it locks it. And now it's unlocked. For this one, you gotta go like this. No, wait, not like that. Gotta go like this. No, not like that. Okay, so you 1, 2, 3, bam. Bam, bam, and then you wham, and then you hold it. And then it turns itself off. Once you hold it. Disrespect is real. I did say I was doing a video, but, you know, in one ear and out the asshole. You know, that, you know, it's pretty stupid. I can't wait. For the time that I have my own room, I will freaking soundproof that room. Nothing comes in, nothing goes out. Like, 
a lawyer meeting, confidential, whatever I say in there is whatever I say, and, and nothing can disturb my videos then. But the E-Leaf Lexicon, I do recommend, but only if you're ready to go to battery-operated devices, which I always am. I keep a watchful eye on the battery life, and it's pretty good 18650. I like it. So, with that being said, I'll see you next one with the next mod.